let's take a look here at the Indiana New York game tonight. And going to go back to the old axiom: if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And we're going to look at the Indiana Pacers team total here tonight, listed at 108. Indiana now firmly back in this series at 2-2. They still own the significant depth advantage, not telling anybody anything new there. And their offensive pace is going to continue. New York's defensive wear and tear showing up a bit by bit here. Really showed up the other day, Sunday afternoon, when they allowed 121 points. And the Pacers have established the fact that they're just going to continue to hit the gas pedal. They even had a subpar 20-point fourth quarter on Sunday in Game 4, and they were still able to get to 121. Prior to that, they had a 22-point quarter uh, in Game 3 and still were able to get well above tonight's total here of 108. So Indiana now 8-1 and one in their last nine postseason games here this season, scoring 111 points or better. That's eight of their last nine where they put up 111 or better. And let's couple that with the fact that the Knicks defense has really shown holes in these playoffs. Seven of their last eight games, they've given up 111 or better. So combine those two together, and certainly mathematically, this one adds up. The loss of OG and Anobi has certainly hurt um, the, the, the Knicks here. Add to that Mitchell Robinson. It's just a mess at the rim. So we think Indiana will be able to press the pedal and score. They've averaged 60 and a half points in the paint inside this series. They've averaged 117 and a half overall in this series and 119 right here at Madison Square Garden. I'd look for them to get into 115 plus point range again here in what should be another high scoring affair. I'd expect the Knicks to play a little better here offensively tonight, obviously off of the bad performance in game four, but Indiana has just been a steady ship as far as scoring points is concerned. They had two games in these playoffs, game one jitters at Milwaukee, new to the playoff experience, and then game five jitters in Milwaukee when they were brand new to the closeout experience. It's all under their belt now. I like Indiana tonight. Let's play their team total as today's best bet. Up and over 108. Very quickly, want to let everybody know about a wager talk special going on right now for the remainder of the NBA playoffs. $99 special. Get all the games remaining every day left in this NBA postseason. This round two, the remaining games left here, plenty of them still. The conference finals and then the finals. For myself, it's been a really good run. Number one in profit at wager talk since April the 1st and right now. Number one, hitting 72% in the month of May as well. So it's been a good NBA playoff run. Once again, you can get the remainder of the NBA playoffs for just $99 rest of round two, conference finals, and the NBA finals. Good time to get on board.